Hello and welcome to a new lesson in Linux. In this lesson we will be talking about pipes and redirects. First we will talk about the pipe and the pipe is this sign. And by the pipe you can combine several commands using the output of one command as the input of the next command. Let's have a look at it. First I will display the files that I have here by ls-l. As you can see here, I have those files. For example, I would like to display those files by the command less. I will type ls minus l and then insert the pipe sign and then type less. And by the pipe sign here, it means that I am combining those two commands that it will display for me the contents of this file in less. When you press enter, as you can see, it displayed for you the contents of the file in less. Now let's have another example of uh, how to combine by the pipe. Now I will type cat and type the name of a file. And by the command cat, of course, I will display the contents of this file here. Enter. It displayed the file for me. Now, for example, I would like to display this file by less, so I will insert the pipe sign and then type less. And this means that I will combine those two commands together by the pipe sign. When you press enter, it will display it for you in less. Okay, now let's have another example. If you type, for example, ps minus aux, this will display all of the process that's running on the system. You press enter, as you see, it displayed the process for me over here. Now I would like to display this process in less by using the pipe. I will type ps minus aux and then insert the pipe and then type less and enter. And as you see, it displayed for me the process in less by combining the two commands. Now let's have another example. I would like to view the contents of a file by the name number.txt. As you see here in the file it has the numbers from 1 to 9. I can use the pipe uh, command here number.txt. For example, I would like to sort it upside down. I will type sort minus r. If I press enter, as you see, it combined for me those two uh, commands. And you can see here the numbers are upside down. Of course, you can use the pipe to combine more than two commands for three or four you can type several commands with the pipe sign. For example, I would like to display the contents of this file and sort them upside down, like this comment here. And I wanted to display it for me in less. I will press enter. And it displayed it for me upside down in less. Okay, and now we have talked about the pipe and how to use it and how to combine several commands together by the pipe sign. Now we will talk about the redirect. And redirection simply means capturing output from a file, comment, program, or script, or even a code block within a script and sending it as an input to another file, comment, program, or a script. Let's have a look at it. First, I will display the, <coughs> the files that I have here in this directory. Now, I would like to send this information into a file and save it. I will type ls-l and then insert the bigger than sign. And this sign is called the redirect output. And then I will type the name of the file, ls.txt. And that means that I am asking the shell to get this information that's out of the ls-l and send them to 
the file ls.txt I'll press enter now I would like to display the ls.txt file ls.txt and press enter as you see here the information is successfully printed inside the ls.txt when we have used this command the redirection command for example I would like to save all of the process information in a file first I will type ps minus a U X. Here, these are the information of the process that's going on. I would like to get all of this information and send them to a file and save them. I will type ps minus aux and then the redirection sign and then the name of the file process.txt and enter. Okay, here it seems that it's uh, not accepting the minus here in the aux, so I will repeat the same command again, but I will remove this minus and I'll press enter. <coughs> now I will display the contents of the file process.txt. Press enter, and as you see, it displayed for me all of the process that I have redirected in the file or sorry I mean the process that has been redirected in this file and as you see here we have talked about the redirect output which is the bigger than sign and this takes the output and inserts it in a file there is a redirect input which is the smaller than sign and the redirect input takes the input from the file to the command for example if I type sort and then redirect input and then number dot txt by this command this command will take what's inside the file inside this file and make it an input for the command I press enter it will sort for me the numbers in file and by that we have talked about the pipes and the redirects thank you for watching and see you in the next session